Remember, whenever you see a screen in Passport showing data columns at the top, like we have here, those data columns can be sorted and filtered multiple ways. In order to add additional data columns to this view, click on the plus button, choose the columns option, and then select the checkboxes for the attributes you'd like to see. To begin filtering data, click into the text box at the top of the column, and then type in the information you need to filter for. Once the information's in the box, click on the filter to the right, and then apply the filter you need. If you need to filter by additional attributes, again, repeat that process by going to the top of the column where you need to filter for that information, type in that information into the text box, and again, choose the filter and select the filter that you'll need. In order to sort data by a particular attribute here in Passport, you can do that either by coming up to the column header at the top and then clicking the column itself and this will organize the data by that particular attribute or you can take the column header itself and drag it up to the top here and then drop it and this will allow you to again now sort by that new attribute. If you need to sort by multiple attributes again just grab the column you'll need and drop it up at the top and now we can see here that we'll be able to sort by multiple attributes at once. And finally, if you need to export the data that's in this data grid, at that point you can come over to the top right and export it either to an Excel spreadsheet, PDF file, CSV file, or a Microsoft Word file. Just click the corresponding button and it'll export within that format.